Hey, what's up, you guys? Shadow Miss Prime here doing another P.O. Box pickups video. Today is August 29th. I think today is the 29th, right? It's Friday and it is the 29th. Um, yeah, we're coming to a close with August over here, man. Sad times. Um, next time I do a video, uh, well, uh, next week I will have my uh, contest finalists or my contest winners announced. So you have that to look forward to. That will be coming next week. All right. And I have um, just wanted to say, um, well, I just have two packages here that that came in the mail. So thanks to you guys doing that. And I will get to these in a second. But uh, just wanted to say that tomorrow night at 9:24 Gilman. Uh, the band I play in, the Mangs, we will be playing over there at Gilman, and our show starts pretty early, so um, I, I recommend being there at 7.30, I'm, I gotta get there at like 1pm tomorrow, so yeah, I'm gonna be there really early, but uh, we play pretty early, so 7.30 uh, is the time to be there if you want to show up at 9.25, Gilman, tomorrow, Mangs, playing in Gilman, uh, Green Day's played there, Rancid's played there, uh, a lot of famous bands, uh, AFI, Offspring, uh, No Effects, like a ton of, ton of my favorite bands have played there. So, yeah, if you can check out the show, you know, come through, watch me play the drums, you know, I, I love playing the drums, so I play the drums. Uh, this hand did not look right. Anyway, I digest. Uh, on to what came in the mail, um, and about my band. Yeah, you may not like punk rock music, so you may not want to go, but, uh, yeah, you want to show some support. Uh, for your local musicians, the Mangs, uh, come on by over in Berkeley, 924 Go. I'll have the address and details in the description below. But anyway, um, yeah, gotta make sure I get all this passed away. I noticed um, somebody left a comment talking about me, uh, you know, slowing down on my reviews. And, I'm, I, you know, I have one a day right now, just trying to make time for other things and whatnot. I uh, still have to clean up the dork room, you know, it's helping me get time for, you know, finishing up this contest finally, you know. I reviewed, I think it's my my last San Diego Comic Con exclusive figure, I actually uh, just reviewed, like, posted not that long ago, and yeah, but there's been other stuff coming in. Anyway, it says here, hey, Shardimus Prime, hope things are going awesome for you and the lovely Charlita One. For me, I'm good. That's great to hear. Uh, gotten a few figures for my organized chaos collection. Uh, unfortunately, I can't write down of what I got in this letter because, well, you need the time to do other letters and packages for your PO box pickup picks up pickup video goes. Oh wow, what a weird moment. Okay, so to me, I'm very tired, by the way. Okay, uh, I had really one of those days where I, when I woke up, I just want to go right back to sleep. Yeah, it was just weird. Uh, just. Tired. Um, anyway, uh, so to make this short and sweet, I send you copies of my of two of my drawings and a picture in which I think is hella sick with a touch of badassery. Uh, the pictures are uh, the the pictures are one is a Spider Man slash Ultimate Warrior face paint design. Uh, rest in peace, Ultimate Warrior. Uh, second one is my own supervillain, Darkus. And finally, well, you have to see it to believe, but it's six inch NECA Godzilla holding the Doctor Wu Rainstorm of the big freaking gun. Uh, it's a weapon set for Generation Springer. Uh, but by the way, Darkus, I think it's pretty funny that you mentioned Darkus because there's a local Denny's just down the street from here and there's this waitress named Darkus. <laughs> and I didn't believe my brother when he was first started talking about Darkus. And it and it's a god awful waitress, like this really old lady who would screw everything up and then on top of it, she was just so old that you felt hella bad for her. So now, like, you now, now you're getting terrible service, and then you can't even get mad about it because it's this whole hella old lady who smoked like way too many cigarettes and everything. And darkest, <laughs> so my brother's like, "Oh damn it, it's darkest." I'm like, "Oh, what? Well, it's darkest." And sure enough, this elderly woman shows up with the badge that says "darkest" right over there. Anyway. Um, so yeah, that, it's kind of your villain, it's my villain too. Well, she's not a villain, but anyway. Uh, well, you and Charlie want to have an awesome day, and sorry that I didn't give you any shard art this time around, but when I do, I'll send it to you. Ezekiel82, oh, Ezekiel82, he sent stuff before in the past. He's got shard art on there. Ooh, this is cool. Yeah, I like his art, man. This is nice. So this is the Ultimate Warrior slash Spider-Man mask. It's actually really cool. It's pretty, it's pretty awesome. I dig that. That's a nice design. It's not too shabby at all. Now you gotta see like a, ooh, and here's Darkus, which looks a lot 
like the waitress. No, it doesn't look like the waitress at all. The hair kind of does, I guess. But there's Darkus. Boom. Looks like he's sucking energy from the earth. That's pretty neat. I, I, I actually really like this design right here. <laughs> what happened to me, man? Told you I'm tired. Uh, and then here's... <laughs> <laughs> then here's the weaponized Godzilla over here. That's awesome. Yeah. Right on, man. Thank you, Ezekiel. Right on, dude. Very cool. And then we have this other package over here, which um, came from Cody, local. Cody's just over in, uh, wait, where does it say? Well, I'm not going to give out his address, but yeah. Uh, wait, for some reason I thought, okay. For some reason I thought Cody was from around here. Why did I think that? But says Alabama on, on the packaging. So, damn. Thank you very much, Cody. Uh, I have a feeling I, I know what this is. I'm going to try to open this very carefully over here. Getting away from myself. I don't want to turn, in, turn this into one of them nasty videos I've been seeing on Facebook all the time lately. I mean, I don't really mind that much. Wow. This looks... Alright, let's see here. Oh, yeah. There's a letter. Let's read the letter first. And we get the... Cool. We got the action card game of the White Ranger. Alright. And here it says, It's sharing time! <laughs> and let's see here. Oh, it says, Hey, Shortimus! Thank you so much for being a friend and supporter. You helped inspire me to do my own channel, Ranger Collector 62492. Uh, link in the description below. Check that out. And I love to give back when I can, so enjoy this gift I packed for you. Thanks so much. And then here's his Ranger sharing time. It's the bolt right there. Thank you so much, Cody. And I know you went through some trouble to get this for me, which is really, uh, really means a lot. Thank you, man. Thank you. And then, ah, cool. Right on, he got some shard art right here. Shard art, it's kind of weird to say. But yeah, nice, man. Put that up at uh, shardmasprime.net. That's what I'm going to do. Putting it up at shardmasprime.net. I've been updating that. And I got my own morpher. That is just too awesome. The Shardimus morpher. I really like that a lot. That is cool, bro. Thank you so much, Cody. This is awesome. This is really awesome. Damn, what, what a bonus, dude. And then here's the figure itself, which I told him I would review, because he wanted me to re and I think I've had other people re uh, request this too. Uh, this is the armored, uh, I don't know exactly what this line is, but it's basically like the Marvel Legend, th these are the Bandai America uh, posable Power Rangers, a attack, attach battle gear, I can't read, see, uh, po oh, yeah, it's in different languages, but the armored, the armored Mighty Morphin White Ranger. Ah, uh, here we go, Super Mega Force. So yeah, there it is right there. Doesn't look like he has ankle pivot though, but it looks very poseable. Reminds me of the Lion-O figure, so I definitely have to compare this to Lion-O, because he has those thigh joints, uh, where you can see like the muscle cut right up here. That reminds me of the Lion-O figure, so it's, yeah, that that's what looks like where it came from and everything. Right on, man. Thank you, Cody. Yes, I will be reviewing this. Awesome. This looks actually very dope. Uh, I'm digging it. Anyway, that's that's the stuff I got in the mail and the P.O. box. Uh, if you guys want to send your letters and artwork, uh, it's Shardimus Prime, P.O. Box, 384 Pacific California, 94044. And yeah, um, I, you know, stay tuned. I got a lot of reviews coming up. And uh, Ninja Turtles, Transformers for the weekend. And then, uh, then some other stuff uh, coming up next week. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.